There is nothing like your first sip of your fifth cup of coffee for the day. Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Miley. If you're new here, I do a new DIY video every single week. So if you would like, subscribe to my channel. So this week I have not just one, not even just two, not even three, but five different DIYs planned out. It is going to be a fun week. So I always have a ton of projects planned out and I thought I would do a new DIY every single day this week. Well, every single day of the business week. So today is Monday and here is my first DIY this week. So in my living room, I have a really long couch with two chaise lounges on each end. And say I was sitting on one of the chaise lounges with my sixth cup of coffee for the day, there isn't really a good place nearby for me to set my coffee down. So what I'm going to be doing is making a little wooden cap that just pops right onto the arm of the couch. So that's the first DIY this week. Let's get started. Tuesday, I have my painting pants on. You know what that means. I'm gonna be painting. So today's DIY is actually a DIY I did a few weeks ago on the stairs going up into our living room. But now I'm going to be continuing the same DIY and design on the stairs going down into our lower level and showing you guys how I did it. So that's my DIY for today. Let's get started. It's hump day, three DIYs to go. So I started an Etsy shop for home decor and fashion and jewelry, and I picked up these items that I've wanted to list for a while, but I've wanted to do a little something something to them before I listed them. So the first two items I have are these sugar and coffee pot combo things that I'm going to be doing that paint and baking soda mixture that I've seen a whole bunch of people do on vases and other things like this. 
And the other thing I picked up are these balls because in every home decor magazine or blog, every cozy home has a bowl of balls. I am not sure why. So what I wanna do to my balls is take some joint compound, which I've seen a whole bunch of people take plain joint compound and make some abstract art on canvases. And in a previous video, I mixed joint compound and paint and painted a canvas and I really liked it. So now I'm gonna be taking that same technique and trying it out on a 3D object. So that's my third DIY for the week. I'm gonna get started painting. today uh my dining table on one side there's a bench and on the other side there's some chairs i don't know when i got them but like a year ago or so i picked up these chairs and i painted and i reupholstered them well over the year they have taken a little bit of a beating and there's some areas that need to be glued back together and also i painted them white and white and food not the best mix so after I take some wood glue to them, I'm going to be painting them and re-reupholstering them. I really don't want to say let's get started, but uh, let's get started. <laughs> Friday guys. It has been a long week of DIYing and not gonna lie, I 
did save the easiest DIY for last. But I'm still really excited to do this DIY. I was at Ikea, hint, hint, wink, wink, for my next video, and I saw this. It's a um, scatus. That is probably not how you pronounce that, but I'm gonna call it a scatus. And it's meant to be for organizing your office or craft supplies, and I am going to be using it for none of that. So I'm probably not the first one to do this, but I haven't seen anybody else do this, so I'm going to be turning this into a custom jewelry holder. The scatus, you can get all of these different components, hooks, little ledge thingies, all this stuff. Um, so what I'm going to be doing is painting this and painting those to match the colors in my room. And that is my last DIY for the week. Let's get into it. <laughs> was a full week of DIYing and I love every single one of them and I'm so happy to finally have these projects crossed off my to-do list. If you liked this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and if you're not subscribed to my channel, hit that notification button so you know when I post and I will see you guys next week. Bye guys!